All right, we've had a lot of heavy news here this morning. Something to make you smile. An animal rescue opened in Brownsburg a few years ago to help the growing number of pot belly pigs ending up in shelters and abandoned by families. Oinking Acres Farm and Rescue Sanctuary is not only finding new families for these pet pigs, but also trying to educate the public about farm animal rescue. Hey, can you say hi? Hi, baby. Olivia had started fostering potbelly pigs like Pua when she was just 14 years old. He came from Vanderburg Humane Society. Right now, Oinking Acres has 88 pigs on the farm, most of them potbelly pigs. Hi, now. They see these cute, tiny little piglets, and they're, they are exceptionally cute, and they do have potential to make great pets, but they're not the best pet for the average household. They need lots of space. They need a special veterinarian care. And once these domesticated pop bellies live in a home, they can't really be returned to barn life. Olivia has their space decorated like a typical home, blankets, beds, even Bonanza playing on the TV. And Olivia says, don't underestimate the pig. They're the third smartest animal in the animal kingdom. Uh, they have the ability to outperform a five-year-old child on a cognitive test. They're highly emotional. When they're happy, they wag their tails just like dogs. And when they're sad or upset, they cry real tears. Um, they're highly trainable. They can be housebroken, crate trained, harness trained. Um, any, anything you can train a dog to do, you can train a pig to do. They have a lot of company on the farm. It's two cows, one donkey, a miniature horse, eight goats, uh, six rabbits, four cats, one peacock, two peahens, a guinea, a pheasant, a turkey. And I think I've got everybody. <laughs> Winking Acres is not only a sanctuary for animals, but also a farm for tourism. Opened up to groups to come on the farm and learn more about the animals and their needs and the importance of farm animal rescue. <laughs> They really are so cute. Uh, so if you'd like to learn more about Oinking Acres or plan a visit, maybe with a classroom, you can head to WTHR.com slash to the rescue. You can also nominate a shelter by writing to us. And many of their animals are ready for adoption. So we're going to show you some of those today at noon. And if you are looking for a pot belly pig, mm -hmm. she gets many of these little babies in there. A lot of people want to start with babies. So she says, please don't buy one. Don't get on the internet. This way you can adopt from her, mm -hmm. get someone a home, and then yeah. also she can help educate you a little bit more about owning a pot belly and pig to make it a success. And that's so important because I think you see all the time, I'm sure she will tell, she probably told you this, that people get the little tiny pigs and are told, these will stay, these will stay yeah. small. And then you get that's people like, she has I so have many an apartment. And now they've stuck with this really big pig you can't take care that's of. That's the problem. Right. By the way, a pig's domicile was nicer than my first apartment yes. because <laughs> right. that, that was sweet. Yeah, yeah that's couch TV. TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Made.